Hi and welcome to our informational video on a Hikvision DVR. Today I'm going to cover the record functions with inside the main menu of the Hikvision DVR. First start by right clicking on your DVR and come to menu. If you're prompted to put your password in, please enter your password. Next click on record. After you're in record, the first tab you will see is schedule. On this side you can see you've got event, motion, alarm, M slash A, M and A. If you have got motion detection set, you will need to click on motion and select the time you want motion to be recorded. I will be creating a video about motion detection on the Hit Vision DVR. You will need to change the setting for each camera that you have installed. The next is the parameters. Here, it's about what definition the DVR records in. Mainstream, continuous and mainstream event. Mainstream event is if you have motion detection set on, which I will explain in a future video. The stream type is video and audio. If you have a microphone enabled uh, camera, then you can have video and audio enabled. In my case, I'm going to leave it in a video and audio. The next is the resolution. You have got different sets of resolution which your uh, DVR records in. 1280x1080p is the highest resolution this DVR can record in. 352 by 288 is the lowest. We recommend you to have your DVR recording on the highest resolution and also for the event. Next is the bitrate type, which is continuous and continuous. We recommend you to keep on continuous as variable and it can, doesn't always record. The next is the frame rate, full frame, full frame. We recommend you to leave it on full, full frame as this is the best FPS rating you can have. The max bitrate mode, leave it on general, don't change it to custom as custom is lower than the general setting. The next is the maximum bitrate, we recommend you to have it on the maximum and also on the event as well. This is to make sure you get the highest quality picture. These settings cannot be changed, these are nothing to worry about. At the top right of the screen you can see here you've also got substream. Substream is for a mobile viewer. You can have a video or video and audio. We recommend you to keep it on video. This is to make sure you get the best quality on your phone. Next is the resolution you can have on your phone. We recommend you to leave it on 352 by 288. This is just to ensure that you don't get any lag or any stopped movement while you while you are watching on your TV or on your phone. You can go to a higher setting, but you will need really good internet connection or a fast download speed by your internet provider. For example, if you have got 4G, we recommend you to leave it on 352 by 288 as default. The next is the bitrate type, leave it on constant. Next is the frame rate, leave it on full. Next is the bitrate mode, again leave it on general. Then is the max bitrate. We recommend you to leave it on 512 as most mobile phones work best. As you can see here, it's recommended you to, you to have it on 384 to 6 to 640. Five, uh, 512 is around the average. Next is advanced. In the advanced setting, you only have one option, which is overwrite. Overwrite allows the DVR to overwrite the hard drive once it becomes full. If you want to overwrite then your DVR will stop recording completely. We recommend you to have overwrite ticked. The next tab is the holiday tab. If you're going on holiday then you can enable your DVR to record continuously. It will do this by default so this section has nothing to worry about.
That's it for the record section. I will be creating videos on camera, configuration, maintenance and HD day. I will also create a video on playback. If you have any questions, please contact us. Thank you for watching our informational video about the hip vision record section. So you do it from your house.